Good evening. Paying the price to protect tonight. Hamilton County deputies are working overtime to make sure Lincoln Heights is safe. Its police department was disbanded earlier this month, but without a formal agreement, the sheriff's office is patrolling the village of Lincoln Heights without pay. Not on your sides. John Genovese joins us with the latest developments. John? Julie, no matter the circumstance, when someone dials 911, they expect help to arrive. Now, so far, several agencies have stepped up to answer calls in Lincoln Heights, but the sheriff's office says they've been hit the hardest, with some investigators even being put back on patrol. Extra hours and temporary reassignment for more than two weeks, it's something Hamilton County deputies have been forced to deal with. Over several years, we have been faced with valid and frivolous lawsuits. We pay a premium and we pay a deductible. When those lawsuits are about. Lawsuits that village officials say left Lincoln Heights unable to pay for insurance to keep its police department up and running. The reason why the decision is so hard is uh, we can look at it financially and know that it's going to be a hard burden for the village to carry, but at the same time trying to show our commitment to the officers that have been here for years. Now the department is officially no more. Leaders are trying to hammer out a contract with the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office, but until that happens, deputies and nearby police departments are essentially volunteers to answer calls. Sheriff's Office spokesman Mike Robinson told us, quote, we don't have the budget to continue to patrol without reimbursement, adding we're kind of under the gun right now to work quickly with the village manager. He says the Sheriff's Office wasn't notified by village leaders until the day their police department shut down. He says ever since they've been scrambling to make sure the 4,000 people there are safe. We're told the Sheriff's Office hopes to finalize a contract with Lincoln Heights in the next two to four weeks, but in the meantime, they say this situation is putting a big strain on their budget and resources. For now, John Genevieve, C9, on your side. All right, John, at least.